All right, good afternoon, um, my um, Fishing with Edwin family. Um, today I'm gonna show you guys how to make a stakeout pole. Very super easy. Um, everything costs pretty much like less than $10, I wanna say. Uh, go to like a hardware store, Home Depot or Lowe's. I'm just gonna do everything step by step. get started on this uh, stake pole um, excuse if the wind starts blowing here and there if you can't hear me um, please bear with me um, that's why I decided not to go fishing today so I could do these DIY projects so um anyways first off I'm gonna go ahead and start off with the you know um, with the drill bit about the size of these machine screws right here all right connect that all right, we're gonna put a hole through this a T connector. Just one hole, straight down, all the way through. All right, there's our hole. We do a stake pole, and then we're gonna do another hole. We gotta get a tight, firm grip on that thing. Sorry, I don't have any work benches or anything like that. The best I can do is go through that fiberglass. It's a little tough, but it'll go through. All right, got the hole um, through um, both ends. All right, we'll connect that. Got a machine screw. Switch our bits. Let's see if I can find a little tool set. I know I got a bunch of junk in here. Excuse all that. Party foul. So yeah, that's kind of what I call that. All right. I'm gonna replace it with uh, the right kind of. Okay, so that's a. Uh, Gonna be a Phillips. I don't know, just uh, get a Phillips at it's about just through here. Okay, connects pretty good. All right, I'm gonna put it through these holes. Get it through that hole. All right, now we got on both sides. What we do is, just, uh, yeah, excuse that. That's from a previous project, and I put that hole in, but that's okay. The bottom paint uh, this whole thing black in the future, and I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna go at that. But for right, for right now, I'm just uh, demonstrating so you can make a stakeout pole, especially when you're fishing fishing kayaks in salt water, like you know the flats and the coast. It's just a cheaper option, you know, less than ten dollars for everything. You know, saves a lot of money than buying those $70 stakeout poles or those $50 ones at Academy. Sometimes I sell them for more, but you should be guaranteed to work. So I'm planning on using this on the next uh, trip that I go to the coast of Port Lavaca. Plan on going in like two weeks. All right, so basically I got that in place. Let's see how, you know, I'm yeah, nice and firm right there. You know, it's not coming loose or anything. All right, now we got the um, machine screw in place. I'm gonna get this, uh, 
little bolt cutter right here and cut that end off. Right, try to hold it in place. All right, there we go. Ends off. All right, so tighten this up a little bit. Just gonna find a screwdriver to do that. All right, got one here. Tighten it more. Okay, there we have it, folks. Too easy. I got a stake out pole for the salt water. The six footer. I'm gonna come out here and then test it in the ground. So how well this thing will um, drive right through the ground. I know we had a little bit of rain the other day, so. All right, good enough. All right, and there we have it, folks. Um, stake out poles. Any questions, uh, comments, or uh, concerns? Feel free to comment. If not, um, just uh, go ahead and subscribe to my YouTube channel.